Last time I flew, we were headed for Regensburg in Germany. The flight was terrific. You could almost walk on it. happened uh, to be hit by flag very bad underneath and in the wing the uh, first engine and I didn't know how bad it was so when uh, we're shooting away there's about a dozen measure smiths came along of us that were straggling. The first one went down and uh, nobody came out. I saw it go down and I looked and look at the fire of ours. I said, well, it may not be long for us. So and another plane went, they went the other way some distance. They crash landed. The first thing you know, I says, well, I don't hear the word bail out. I says, the fire's getting real bad and the fighters are 20 millimeters are coming through the airplane. So I says, I better get the ball turret man so that he could get his shoot on. So that when we get the word bail out, we just jump out, that's it. So I headed down there, I put my oxygen bottle, which is this here. And, and you're wearing an electric suit? Yeah, something similar suit. to what you you're wearing there, yeah. only it's, uh, uh, it's wired. Wire running through it like an electric blanket. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and I went with it in my mouth. I went over there, and then I tried to use the crank, which is over there, try to crank it for him, for the door to open over here. Yeah. Couldn't even budge it. So yeah. he, he must have got hit real bad. Was your other gunner here? Yes. And where, he, where was he at the time? Well, I don't you remember. I don't remember at the time. He remember. was just standing and firing away yeah. while I was trying to get him out. I'm getting low on oxygen, so I put on uh, one hook of my shoe, and then I don't remember anything that happened except when I woke up in the air about like 5,000 feet. must have got blown straight out the window. Yeah, straight out. The parachute was all, sh there was nothing left to it, only the cords. And the rip cord was still in, so I didn't dare touch it. I reached for my crucifix, you know, which I carried all the time here. And I couldn't, <laughs> I couldn't find it. And I says, well, that's it. And the first thing you know, it was, just look, I just glided down along the, uh, it was all snow from here to the end, from as far back as those trees down there. It was all snow. And I happened to glide right down and skidded and skidded all the way. And I, I landed and uh, I was look, lucky enough, I woke up in the snow, you know, I says, what am I gonna do now? You know, figure uh, With no shoes, how am I gonna do? So I just got myself, uh, you know, uh, snow for the time being. I said, if I'm lucky, I'm not gonna try to walk out of here. So uh, the following day, after the following day, I stayed overnight in the snow. I built some snow, a little snow hut, and got myself underneath, even though, and, uh, the following day, all of a sudden, I see in the distance somebody coming in uh, on skis. I says, "Oh God bless!" And they 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 got to me. Thank goodness that they were that day there. They uh, they were having a wedding further down, and they saw all the action of the B-24 fighting with the fighters. So. They happened to look up and they happened to see something come down. So they got curious. 
few of them. Yeah, and they they came up, and luckily enough, they found me, and uh, this is where I am here today. And and believe me, it's uh, it's uh, it's something that you try to to relate and and leave it to the good Lord that uh, that I survived this here, not knowing the circumstances. And on my mother's birthday, her prayers must have been uh, answered. How many crew members were on the plane at the time? Uh, there was uh, that day. There was one extra man. There was uh, eleven of us. So, and uh, one of them was uh, flying his last mission, and he was going home after. You know, he had flown with us before, but uh, he wanted to finish up and go home. Never made it. So you can see that uh, it's all a matter of. Uh, God's will, that's it. Bring back memories. <laughs> when the plane took off, is this, was this your spot here? Uh, yeah, we, uh, we, uh, we, uh, we never were strapped. Okay. We just stood up. You just stood up? Yeah. So you you know. stand there oh, and yeah. you were taken off? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you, you would never, you would never, they didn't have anything like this. Okay, no seatbelts. No, never. <laughs> A good landing. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. I think that's the best landing I've been in for a long, long time. Oh yes. Yeah. The good Lord is still with me. 